ONDC is an abbreviation for Open Network for Digital Commerce. Um, uh, it's, a, it's an acronym. It's, a, it's basically uh, um, an initiative done by the government of India. Uh, this is possibly the second initiative of a similar kind. They did a similar one for payment gateways called the UPI, which was the United uh, you know, Payment Interface, which they had launched some time back, which was a massive success. And uh, ONDC is something that they're doing for e-commerce. Uh, essentially, which is based on the same principles. Uh, what it essentially means, as the word suggests, it's an open network, which means it's an open source network. And uh, what they're trying to create is a level playing field where sellers and buyers have interoperable uh, transactional relationships, which means today, for example, if you take a look at a relationship between a seller and a buyer, they are defined by the platform or a marketplace like an Amazon or a Flipkart or um, you know, uh, 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 any social platforms, etc. They're all linear, which means a seller has to register into that particular platform and a buyer, which is a consumer like me, will have to register into an Amazon and buy only from Amazon. So that means the sellers have to register in multiple platform if they need to sell uh, to, you know, multiple buyers. And similarly, consumers like me will have to register onto different apps and different platforms to access any one of these sellers. And I can only access them if they are registered on those platforms. So what ONDC does is it's, it's breaking that silos and making sure that the sellers and buyers are interoperable, which means I just need to list myself once in a particular platform as a seller, and I am actually accessible through any buyer application. Similarly, as a buyer, I could just you know, go through an, uh, an existing app, for example, as a, as a consumer, and I'm, my, my, I can actually access sellers across uh, the whole network, not necessarily from an Amazon or not, not necessarily from a Flipkart, which means if I'm not registered on an Amazon, I'm still discovered through the uh, interoperability of uh, ONDC as a network, which I thought is absolutely mind blowing because it completely changes the dynamics of uh, you know, data, um, discoverability, uh, the, the, uh, you know, the, uh, the proposition, which is, uh, you know, the, the backbone of India is traditional trade. And what this basically does is is able to get traditional trade quickly onto an e-commerce uh, enabled environment very fast. 